What's up guys, we got a very, very, very special announcement for you guys today. Stance Galleria, Galleria Stance. Collaboration of the year. We got Stance at the Galleria, available for retail now. Every single sock, color, combo, flavor you want, we got you. Laker fans, Dodger fans, Angels, Astros, Disney fans, we take care of you. I bet you we're gonna be showing you guys some stuff in this video today that you guys have never seen before, so do not miss out. Right here, I bet you guys have never seen this years ago. Stance and the Simpsons. Let's open it up, let's check it out. I know some of you guys got the Nike SB Bart Simpsons. Well, guess what? You didn't think you needed these, but you need these. The Duff Beer, the Bart Simpson, the Moe's Collector's Dream Shoe. A lot of these right now, hidden on GOAT, StockX, $1,000 to $2,000 a pair. And guess what? We have every single Mr. Cartoons that has came out in every color that they've made. That's the Mexico pack. I call this one, you know, the LA right there. It's a classic. A lot of people are messing with the browns right now. Everybody's saying the browns are Travis Scott's color. I don't know, Mr. Cartoons did it first. If you guys don't know about Mr. Cartoons, look it up. He's a very, very, very famous tattoo artist based in LA. And he even has his own collection with Stance and Uno combined. So let's check that out right here. It's a Mr. Cartoons Uno Stance pack. If you open it up, it's got that Uno stance and the Uno card set. But just if you thought the socks were enough, we got the Uno Air Force Ones. I bet you a lot of you have never even seen this shoe. It has every single color pattern of a Uno deck of cards has. We got the new Otani pack that hasn't even came out yet for stance. So we're gonna be showing you guys that today too. But I mean, you can't go wrong with the new Otani stuff and you know, the Dodger SBs. But you know, since we got that, we gotta pay homage to the Dodgers, even though a beer and a soda is gonna be $100 this season. Parking is gonna be 100 bucks. A bag of peanuts is probably 35. Who really knows? I do feel bad for Mike Trout though, cause damn, Angels ain't gonna be nothing. They might be giving away tickets. A dollar for an Angels ticket, guys. Can you believe that? A dollar. That is like the saddest thing ever, right? Anyways, some newer arrivals that many of you have probably never seen. The Kobe 4 Gift of Mamba. I personally didn't like this one. I like the colorway, but if you can tell closely, it doesn't really resemble snake skin. It kind of looks like fish gills to me. So, I mean, I usually like the work that Vanessa and Nike have been doing lately. This one is, you know, another nice one too, the Babesta. We got these straight from Japan. My brother took a visit over there, so we got these straight from Japan. If y'all were wondering, they've been coming out with so many good shoes this year that it's like, what can you pick? I mean, the Reimagined 4, a lot of people are indifferent about it. I've seen people put acetone on it to take the leather off. So it's, you know, you can do a lot of things with them, but this one is a really good shoe, but my sneaker of the year last year between the Haritos, the Pine Green 4, you can't go wrong with that one. It's just super expensive nowadays. So if you're not looking to fork up five to 600 bucks, that one's gonna be a pass for you. The Travis 4 OG, I would say this is the one that kind of took off Travis's line. Yes, he has the Air Force Ones and the Air Force Ones came out, but the Travis Olive, it used to go for two, 300 bucks and now it's a thousand dollars on GOAT, on StockX, every aftermarket place that you're looking for, you can't find those Travises, you know, for anything under that. So we got the Stance team coming shortly. We just laid out a couple samples for them. Not sure what they're looking for in terms of pairing, which colors, which socks, which models. You know, obviously they're coming out with the MLB lines, the NBA lines, the Disney lines. So we color, uh, we color coordinated some of those to go with them and we'll go from there. But, you know, stay tuned with us, stay tuned with Stance. And we're gonna be doing some collaborations soon. So we're putting out some very nice stuff. Shout out to them for pulling through and uh, let's cut to them now. There's, there's nothing on this team. Go, go, go get the guy. What's good, y'all? My name's Reggie Luck at Reg Luck, R E G G L U C K, baby. It's your boy. Yeah, we got a <laughs> gathering at the gallery, putting on shoes, trying socks. That's what we do. I like Kick that. back. What you got on the fit today? Oh, you already know. I got the uh, these called the unknowns because they was just a gift with the with the monkey stance socks right here, stance shorts. I'm gonna call this the unknown as well. Just plain black, little little accessories, you know. You know, just make yourself feel good, feel good, play good. <laughs> it's the I, unknown fit. It's the, it's it's the, the unknown fit. That's what we call it. We're gonna call this the, the UF, the UFO. Yeah, I was. Yeah, Robin. It's your boy. At Champagne Poppy, you probably heard of me. Yeah. Um, 
I'm just playing. At Capstagram. Today I got on full stance tech fit and SB, born and raised in LA. Fine. That's not palette. Let me see. When I, when I first met Archie, uh, I was like, I joined her. Gotta make some matchmaking. Like, I've been in heaven. 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 I've been and they change yeah, it to the like, They're built to get ripped. That's why they look like oh, it's a whole new layer things. underneath. Oh, that cheered me out. I wore yeah. mine and I was, told my wife, I was like, dude, something's like, what's going on behind my heel? I didn't yeah. know it came like that. I thought I had a pair that came messed up. What are these called? I went to uh, Union. 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 So that color like is Union. pistachio. Are these rare as fuck? This was, it wasn't easy. Yeah. I think what, 250, 300 now? Four. Four Jesus. 100 off, I don't need pay like, uh, retail at the beginning? No, uh, 160. Retail? Everything. Uh, I'll have to go for four now? Yeah. Oh, I would still come. Yeah, for four, right? And then there's yeah. a, a nice color. I actually color. was going to wear right now. Today, there was, I brought there's a purple one. The Oakland A's Ugly Ducks. They made it to look like an old school sneaker box. Oh, wow. Well. Gun pack. So, King of the Cards come up. Crazy. So this oh, is this, this is the special box. This was released. This is a Nike. When they do, the SB does some really cool boxes. So this was released with just this box for the public, but it was only this paper. So this paper here comes because of this entire set of wow. boxes. And so nobody got this. Actually, I'm gonna put that away now too. Yeah. We just got one of the most expensive pairs of Air Force Ones in the entire world. This is the Mr. Cartoon Air Force One set. First on the list, we got the blue tattoos. Me personally, this shoe's fire. I'm not sure if I get tattoos, but hey, you know, this one right here is going for about $1,500 to $2,000 on the aftermarket. Next one on the list, I think this one pays homage to Travis Scott. Obviously, Mr. Tattoo was the first one to play with these colors. This is uh, Air Force One Brown Pride. All the way around the shoe, you have laser engravings of Mr. Tattoo, his iconic logo on the inside part of the heel and the outside part of the heel. So just as a reminder, all these shoes are 10 years old at this point. If you were to run in them, they would probably fall apart. You can restore them, but for definitely a collector, these are definitely floating for about $2,000 upwards. Next on the list, a lot of you guys remember Lance Armstrong. This is the collaboration that Mr. Cartoons did with him. These are going for around two to $3,000 on the aftermarket. I personally like this one just because of the toe box. It has a webbing-like feature, and then on the back right here, a lot of Air Forces really didn't do this, but they have suede on the back with a leather combination. And then look at this, the check right here, you can tell that it's aged. Um, a lot of people tell me, you know, and I've seen videos of it, but apparently you can get a heat gun and you can take off um, the residue from that and make it clear again, clear swoosh. So that one's a nice one too. The last one on the list is definitely my favorite though, you know, just because boys in Mexican so this one definitely pays um, homage to home as well this one is the Mr. Cartoons Air Force One I've seen pairs floating for $1,500 to $2,000 I've, I've even seen some sales of $2,500 on eBay this one is definitely one that hits home on the inside as well it has the Los Angeles logo obviously because a lot of Mexicans reside in Los Angeles California and on the air definitely it's cool because you got the green A the white I and the red R. So this pack is definitely one that Mr. Cartoons came out with, you know, back in the day. He's done collaborations with Modelo, Turtle Wax, and Nike. So, you know, all the collections that he's done so far, they're doing really good. Shout out Mr. Cartoons. He's from Pomona, California, right around the corner. So check out this collection. If you guys haven't seen it, it'll be on display here at the Galleria in our display cases. If you're looking to purchase one of these, they'll all be size 10, 10 and a half for sale. Pull up on us.